Okay, there we go. I fixed it. I didn't. Cool. I didn't. I just happened to look up and like the names of the monsters were cut off the top of the screen, and uh, for some reason it was uh, cropped in a weird way. So I don't know how much of the previous recording is like that either. Oh, but shit. Um, it's okay. Like I just know some of the uh, the side is cut off as well, but there really isn't anything important. Anything important cut, I mean. So we're fine now. Good, good. That's much better then. Oh, is he using cure potions? Is that why they're not healing as much? Okay, that would explain Is things. That what's happening? Okay. Oh, whoa, he can... Oh! I mean, that makes sense. They are zombies, after all. Oh, level 20. Let me, let me check Ruben's spell. Yeah, Ruben doesn't have any spells except for life, so... he Whenever he's uh, been he's using cure... Potions. He's using potions, okay. Okay, that makes sense. I was say, I thought he was a fighter type. He wouldn't have, like, spells except for life, because everyone has life. Right. Okay. There's a red chest. There's something important in here. Stronger claw! Nice! The claw! So, glad I went that way. Let's see, where else can I can't go that way, because that conveyor belt's moving in the other direction. Well, apparently they can paralyze now. Or they, at least they could if, uh... Oh, they're called zombies! I thought they were called mummies for some reason. No, they're zombies. I realize that now. See, not only was were the uh, monster names cut off on the re on the recording at first, uh, but also um, I just wasn't looking for a lot of the time. So take 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 that how you will. <laughs> t take take them out. T take them down. Do do your stuff. Do your stuff. Do your stuff. You do have uh, dinosaurs on this uh, dinosaur. Dinosaur tour. Dinosaur tour, yes? I really hate that band. <laughs> I think I said that one at one point we were playing uh, Final Fantasy XIV the other night. Just like out, oh, of, yeah? out of nowhere. There was like no context to it. I was just. I think there might have been dinosaurs in the uh, the floor of the dungeon we were in, but at some point I just, like, said that, and then Jordan was like, I really hate that man. <laughs> nice. So we've, we've reached the stage where we've devol devolved into to useless chatter. Yes. Because, uh... I'm sure this game is a lot would be a lot more interesting if I was speedrunning it already. Oh, that's okay. Um, but I uh, I do need that uh, that end game save file. So why do you need the end game save exactly? There is a glitch that um, if you load up the end game save file, then reset the game, um, and then you know either start mm -hmm. up like I think start a new game. It will overwrite the equipment in um, in the second character slot with the equipment that was in the save slot that was last loaded. Okay. And um, so, like all of the uh, those, like the second characters that you get in your in your party will have all of uh, Phoebe's super overpowered stuff from the end of the game. Okay. Which helps out a lot with uh with the battles and stuff. At least that's that's from what I understand. 
I only kind of glossed over uh, a bit of the guide uh, and the glitches and stuff. Uh, there's also an item glitch that I'll be using of some description. But when I was originally thinking of things that, that could be speedrunning, I, I of course thought the Link's Awakening at first. Um, and then I watched Pronzo um, speedrun Link's Awakening. And, um... Oh boy, uh, that is very technical. Oh yeah? Yeah. Um, or at least the um, at least the uh, the Game Boy Color version is for any percent. Like, there's a point where uh, I don't know how much of the game you you remember, Greg, but um, I mean, even considering that we did like two Let's Plays of it. Um, you remember where, when we were on our way to get the uh, the level 7 key, how there was that that pit that kind of curved around a corner and we had to use the flying rooster to fly over it? Oh, yes. Um, there is a, something called rooster skip, mm -hmm. where you basically jump over that pit, like, one tile at a time, without using the flying rooster. Oh, geez. Because if you if you um, pause the game right when you start falling into a pit, and then unpause it and jump, you'll just jump to like like whatever the tile you land onto next. And you got to keep that up until you round the corner and go to where the key is. Oh, geez. And that's like you know one of the main things you do. And even people who are you know who run run that game. Uh, normally fear that part because it's so hard to, pu to pull off consistently. Uh, I remember watching Pronzo do it and like sometimes it would take him like 20 tries. Oof. And I'm like yeah, I'm not gonna I'm, I'm not gonna speedrun Link's Awakening <laughs> for right now. Fair enough. I, I, I watch a lot of speedrunning now. Mm -hmm. Because, um... I mean, I, I watch... Twitch is one of the main things I have up while, you know... Just off on the side while I'm working anyway. Yeah, of course. And, um... What, what do you watch, primarily, speedrunning-wise? Uh, retro stuff. Okay. Um... And, um... I also am, like, on their, on their discords and stuff. So, like, these are people that... I, I not only interact with through chat, but also through Discord. And, okay. like, on, on some of these, uh, on some of these streams, like, like, they know who I am now. Oh, nice. Um, so folks like Pronzo and JSR and, um, NES Cardinality, mm -hmm. like, will know who I am and how I normally, uh, how I normally act in chat. And he has Cardinality is like one of the like the big boys too. Like he he has world records in like more NES games than I can count. Oh wow! And like people in in, in NES Cardinality's chat know like when whenever he's playing Dragon Quest or Dragon Warrior Four, I should say. I'm I'm the guy who always mimics by the by the cop or sell the copper sword by the wooden hat in the chat as he does it. Okay, I don't know what what does that mean exactly. One of the first things you do, uh, I guess, for for money stuff, um, I don't know with the, with the exact routing and everything, but one of the first things you do is is you because you start off with the copper sword, uh, you sell that sword, and then you buy a wooden hat from the from the uh, the same shop. Oh, sell the copper sword, buy the wooden, wooden hat, and he. Okay, I get I get it now. And I, I I told them at one point. I mean, if you th if it, if it if it looks like I'm spamming this, like you know, just let me know and I'll stop. And and he's like, you know, if if I had like thousands of people watching me at a time, I think that they would just you know eventually start doing that as well. So no, you're fine. Nice. <laughs> I mean, there are there are other. Um, there are other like channels that I watch as well where I'm I'm not as active in chat, but uh, sure. They're I don't all... really do. I haven't been on Twitch in a while. 
I mean, honestly, most of the people I I, I, I watch on Twitch are because of um, like whenever the um, you know the whatever streamer like raids like other streamers, and then I just like you know follow them. Right. Because at first it was Arcus, um, the cowboy guy. Okay. And I and I just oh yeah I remember him. I just started checking him out because of the YouTube channel. And then one one day when he was uh, when he was offline, he was hosting Pronzo. So I just started watching Pronzo, and I started getting more comfortable there. And then just like a lot of people know me from like Pronzo's stream. Okay. And Discord. So. Well, that's cool. go through here already uh, I'm gonna save just in case this is out because I don't want to okay. go out well, that makes sense that's out that is out okay I'm trying to see if there's a soft reset well, it broke up there for a minute I'm trying to see if there's a soft reset okay no there's not a soft reset um so that might make things a little awkward if, uh... Well, maybe not. Hold on. I just don't want to redo all those battles again. Yeah, no. Of course not. Uh, where's Reset? There's Restart. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> oh, so many pixels to render a single drop of water. Nice. All right, there we go. Because now I'm, I'm wondering, you know, looking forward. Oh, whoops! Didn't mean to use the heal potion on myself. Um, like how? How am I going to execute the glitch on an emulator? And if I can't emu execute the glitch on an emulator, then I'll find a way to, um, you know, stream from my my Superboy or something. But. Right, of course. I'm sure there's a way to do it. I mean, streamers do it, right? Yeah, it's just, um... I mean, I could probably set it up through the capture box somehow, because mm -hmm. my, com my computer and my TV are in two completely separate rooms now. Okay. Because my TV's out in the living room. Uh, so, using the uh, capture box, uh, at least for YouTube videos, really isn't as viable anymore. Okay. And I tried using... I tried testing out the stream box uh, recently. And certain things, it doesn't like to stream very well. So... Because I, I tried hooking up my Switch to it. And, right. like, the sound wasn't coming through. Huh. Even though, I, like, I tested it out one that one time with the... Um, with the PS4, and it worked fine. Like, uh, back before I moved. So, I'm not sure if I'm going to... I'll probably just have to look for some some other streaming device. Like, I've seen these... I've actually seen these, like, kind of cheapish, like, $10 HDMI to USB things. Mm hmm And that might be a viable option at first. Or maybe I can get, like, an internal capture card. I'm trying to remember if I've used one of those before. I've used something like that. The USB uh, things or the internal capture cards? The HDMI to USB thing. I remember using some converter like that and not having a great experience with it. Okay. I'm not sure what it was, though. I mean, the reviews seemed positive, but they could also be shills. Oh, no. The ones I found were on Amazon, and and I have an Amazon gift card that I could use because, um, for whatever reason, the uh, my employer gave me an Amazon gift card like a month ago for my work anniversary. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, nice. I don't. Congrats. I don't know how much is on it, but. Well, you should look it up. Yeah, I should. It's one dollar. <laughs> Congratulations! You've won one dollar in the Amazon store. You've been with us for seven years. Have a buck. It's seven bucks, actually. <laughs> seven bucks. They're nice. They're nice. You seven years, seven dollars. Once you make ten, you get ten bucks. <laughs> and it's weird because they hadn't given me anything like that before. I think that's like that's like the first time they they've given me some kind of like a, a gift card or something like that for an anniversary. I mean, they've like within the past couple of years, I think they've sent me cards. Right, but never like a like a gift card. Huh. Right. I mean, like, I think they started sending me cards on, like, my fifth anniversary. It's like, what the fuck, why wouldn't they give you a card for your sixth anniversary? That's fucked up. I mean, no, they gave me one for my sixth, but I'm um, just saying, oh, like, okay. like, starting with my fifth, they started giving me cards. Like, like, just, thank you for being with the company, or congratulations on your anniversary, or whatever, and I'm like, okay, yeah, whatever. Um, but, yeah, this, this time they actually mailed me a gift card from Amazon, and I, like, nice. that's nice of them, but, um... You should tell them that the only card you need is the Ace of Spades. <laughs> I'll get uh, I'll get an Ace. I'll I, I'll buy. I'll use the I'll use the gift card to buy a, a pack of playing cards. Take the Ace of Spades <laughs> out and mail it back to them. <laughs> I got you a card. <laughs> and, and and tell them that if they like to gamble. I'll tell them I'm their you're man. Their, you're, their, you're their man. <laughs> it's all a game to me. The remote control was on the bus. Uh, maybe maybe I should get like some kind of like an internal memory or capture card and that works with Linux maybe and. Slot Maybe that you in. should get a what? I'm sorry. Like an internal you broke up there. Like an internal capture card. Oh. Okay. That works with Linux and see how that works out. I mean, either way, my uh, hooking my Superboy in is gonna be it's gonna look like shit because um, all I have uh, for video out on the on that is just like some like composite video cables. And an HDMI, like just like an, like an AV to HDMI adapter that we've used before, on uh, like the N64 and such. And um, you know, we all know how well that looked when we played uh, like Mystical Ninja and shit. Oh yeah, no, no, it came out not good. I mean, it might look better for like this, but. I mean, if I want to start playing stuff on console again for the channel, I gotta do something. Right. Do you think you're gonna? Do you think you're ever like uh, go back to Twitch? Uh, possibly. It seems like most people, more people are doing that. Than, uh, than the YouTube thing. I know. And that's that's the thing. Like I I know I I mainly want to talk about it in like an update video at some point. But I have been, you know, kicking the old peanut around about taking like an indefinite hiatus from YouTube, at the very least, or if not outright just stopping. Yeah. I mean I. Well I at least want to get through um, through Deus Ex and Oracle of Ages before I make some kind of a final decision on that, but... Okay. But you're thinking about packing it in? Um, on YouTube? On YouTube, yeah. Because... <laughs> you know, I'm not really... I don't feel like I'm getting a lot out of it anymore. No, I, I can understand that. I mean, it's not that... I mean, I know people watch and everything, and that makes me happy, but... It makes me happy to know that I'm, I'm making people happy by watch, by you know them watching. But um, because of how things are, um, you know, I, I, I can't get any exposure, and I also 
can't communicate with people. Because... Right. You know, I'm still paranoid about the whole Copa thing, because I, I, I know a lot of people are ignoring that. But, um... At the same time, I'm just... I'm paranoid enough to believe that, like, the moment I start ignoring it, they're just gonna crack down on me. Sure. I've been going around in circles, like, three times. I can't remember which way to get... <laughs> how to get back over to where I was, because I know where the boss is. I go down this way. I wasn't gonna say anything. Yeah, I'll, I'll make like an up, up an update video at some point about that. But uh, okay, I, I figure if I do go back to uh, to doing stuff like this on the internet, it would probably be through Twitch and. Um, okay. I know that, like, the first time I streamed, like, the only time I streamed wasn't that great of an experience overall. I mean, Fair enough. I mean, it was the first time, though. It was the first time, but I also felt like I was doing stuff that, like, I normally wouldn't have done, and it didn't feel right. Because we were going for the whole trying to get as much exposure as we could. by play We were playing Death Stranding at a point where Death Stranding was kind of on its way out of the, of the limelight, but yeah. also was still oversaturated. And nobody watched. <laughs> yeah, no, I remember that. Oh, that here's a boss. Great. Oh! And he's brought his friends. And I'm sad that you can't hear the rock and boss music. Oh, I am too. Oh, shit, yeah, you need to heal up. I got Hopefully it. Hopefully, will handle that. Yeah, no, you should definitely heal yourself. Thanks, Ruben, but I got it. Oh, well, it's a good thing he did that, then. Because I went last in that. <laughs> in, in, I, I rolled low on my initiative. Yeah, shit, that would have... That would have been bad. <sighs> All right. Now it's time to start sussing out weaknesses. I'm actually going to start after I see what the sword does. I'm actually going to... I'm just going to try to go to Blizzard right away, because he seems like a, uh, a fire-aspected guy. Yeah, he's got that red skin. That's racist. <laughs> no, it is not. I figured it was because we were in a fire-themed area. Actually, he's not weak to water. Okay. Well, let's just use Thunder on him, because that's just a really strong spell in general. Ah! Yeah, he doesn't look happy at all. <laughs> your first wish is that I beat your ass! <laughs> that's weird. Is that your game? Because it, it does, like, a hitch every time you cast Thunder. Um... I don't know. It's going fine on my end. Okay. It must be something on my end, then. It may just be the, um... The buffering or whatever. Yeah. But it's every time you cast the, uh... The thunder, the spell. thunder spell. it happens, which is weird. Yeah, it's fine on my end, so... Spell slots, so I may as well have the black magic. And while he's not weak to blizzard, I have a feeling that he's, he's strong to fire, so. Yeah. Let's see how Quake does. That seemed pretty good. I was gonna just bash him, though. Oh, well, he's dead, so. Yeah. Now we'll never know what his weakness was. He died too quickly. I can always look it up at some point. Turns out his weakness was beating. Ah, uh, Dr. Livingston, I presume. We're close enough to blow up the boulder. Are we, though? That wasn't even close. What the hell? 
Oh, oh no. It's rolling towards the towel. Oh, sweet God. <laughs> we did it. Ruben, I knew you'd save me. Please head home to Mom. Right, you two be careful. Floofers, let's return to Fireberg. Wait, so he could have just gone just gone down that way? Apparently. He could have just gone around the boulder? Listen. Listen. You don't just go around a boulder, okay? It's a boulder. Oh, well, the boulder made it so we can go this way, too. What's in the sealed temple? I'm, I'm just curious. A kiss from a rose on the gray. Oh, no, that's the seal temple. Sorry. Do you have ten gold for a cup of coffee? Okay, bye. Right, heal potions. Cure potions. And I think this will take us to the Wintry Temple. Okay, now we can see what's in here. More cure potions. Particularly Wintry to me. That's what I said when I went in last time. Well, we got a shit ton of cure potions and heal potions, so... That's good. That's a way to restock those. Alright, so let's heal up here. And I guess Ruben's just gonna stick around with us. <laughs> we sleep near the orb. <laughs> the orb brings us happiness, don't you know? I can't wait until I see the orb live. Orb Newton. Orb Newton. Roy Orbison. <laughs> oh, Roy Orbison. Welcome back to mandatory Orbtelica. <laughs> Meg Orb Death. <laughs> Slay orb. Slay orb. I was flipping over, I was flipping through the radio and I, I turned it on the top 40 station and they were playing the new Ta Taylor Swift song. Fuck, I, I stuttered. Fuck! The joke is ruined. Alright, I'm out. Goodbye. <laughs> Tip your waitresses. The sound of a, gun, the sound of a gunshot. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Damn it! Ah! Soil and Greg ooh, will not be joining us for the rest of the playthrough. <laughs> I'm a, Oh, it isn't. I was gonna say, ooh, I'm a ghost, and it's literally called a ghost. Why are your ghost sheets yellow? Oh, uh, urine! It's a urine ghost. Oh, he's a very sad ghost now. Well, don't attack them directly, because they'll confuse you as a counter. So I'm just going to throw bombs at them. Because as we all know, ghosts don't like bombs. I'm the Piss Ghost! <laughs> Ooh, oh, he did one damage. Ooh, he piss. <laughs> oh, it's gross! I may be gone, but the pressure in your bladder remains. Woo. These guys were summoned by the piss wizard, weren't they? <laughs> they are. They're the <laughs> piss wizard's piss ghost. Wizard. <laughs> the wizard. Like, uh, what was it? Fla Flazard? Is that the yeah. Yeah. Wizard, whatever. Yeah, when they got to season seven of uh, of Tree Man, uh, <laughs> Man on ABC, and they added the piss ghost, <laughs> that was like a really weird publicity stuff. That's like when they have a character get pregnant and have like a cute <laughs> baby character or whatever. Yeah, except it was a piss ghost. <laughs> or like if if, a, if an actress gets pregnant and then they're replaced like for a season, yes. and then yes. like they come back and then they have like this cute baby character. Now, I just reminded myself of Dr. Pulaski from the Star Trek The Next Generation and how much she, she sucked. Aww. Because... You have six more encounters with the Pierce Ghost! <laughs> now, they're taking a breather in this one. This one's just the... 
This one's just, um... 70s band Redbone. <laughs> 